Hello and welcome to chapter 34 of The Last Thoughts of a Busy Mind. Honestly, it's around 3.15 a.m. when I'm recording this and I'm going to name this laziness. But right before I record, something happened so idiotic. I'm not even going to talk about it, but it... Well, it made me feel bad, which is why I sound a little bit whiny. I'm a bit teared up at the moment. My uh, drink today is uh, blue curacao syrup and water, you know, classic. For those of you long listeners of the program. And, uh, yeah, why laziness? Because there has been a question in my mind, and uh, am I just plain lazy, or I am lazy because I don't have the right tools? Um, the reason for that is, I'm s- sorry, the reason for that is recently I edited a little something for uh, YASP, which uh, if you listen to the special episode, we talk about that. And do listen to the special episode. Not a lot of people do. And I wish more people did. I'm sorry. I think I'm going to sneeze. (coughs) What the fuck is wrong with me? And uh, I was record. I was editing a little video for that. And if you are on YouTube in my channel, you can go down and find a link to Yasp's YouTube channel. Which I wish you would go there and subscribe or check it out just in general because there are some exciting things happening over there too, pretty soon. And. Um, while I was editing it, um, I realized that I don't really hate editing as much as I say I do. I hate how much time I need to work with my crappy laptop. My laptop is very old and it's been through its paces. I mean, it would really paid for itself at this point. It's It's such a... A fighter, if you may. But, uh, what I was trying to say is, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I lost the f- train of my thoughts. My train of thoughts. Oh, and uh, it's been through its paces, and right now it takes a lot out of it to... Uh, how do I say it? Work with Adobe Premiere, which is what I used to edit videos and edit audio, if you can believe me. Uh, sometimes I edit the episode of Yasp, me and Ami Reza, you know, we take turns doing it. And I edit mine using Premiere, which is a stupid way to do it, but it's the way I know how. And... Uh, I, I realized the act of when, when everything was going smoothly, I didn't hate it. But when I need to wait, uh, for example, I click on a clip and I need to wait approximately like 20 seconds for my laptop to respond. Am I just lazy that I don't do a lot of editing or I don't do a lot of fancy editing stuff that I can do that I know if I try to do, my laptop will show me frame by frame, not being able to render it properly. Or am I just lazy? <laughs> and that question has been wandering around in my head. On one hand, I want to say, no, it's because I don't have the proper tools. On the other hand, I do have a lot of other things that I have the proper tools for. For example, if you again look into iCrafter, my second episode was about drawing with a deep pen set and uh, it's i have it and it works and i've worked with it and i had so much fun why don't i do more 
or maybe because I'm lazy. <laughs> so yeah, that's generally the feeling I have nowadays. Am I just plain lazy or am I just lazy because there is a lack of required material? The, uh, there is the thing um, that, the how do I say it? I don't go out a lot and I don't really go shopping for the stuff I need. I usually either order online, like most people, or I ask my father to buy it for me. <laughs> Which I know sounds like the most spoiled kid shit ever. And guess what? I'm a spoiled kid. Kid. Spoiled kid. And... Uh, the reason I justify it to myself is I don't know how to drive. If I knew how to drive, I would take my dad's car and go buy all of the stuff I need. But I don't know how to drive. Why? No reason. I can go learn. <laughs> I mean, not right now. There is the COVID thing. And Iran has been hit pretty bad. But I could have done the, done it for the last six years. And I still haven't. Yeah. <laughs> um, it makes me think a little bit. And not in a good way. Not in a good way. <laughs> so, I guess I am just lazy. But on the other hand... The editing thing. Yeah, that the editing thing is the only thing I think... Or the, uh, I'm I'm trying to do book binding, but I don't have the material. I don't have the needed wood to, so I can press the pages to get. It's it's stupid. I don't know. I guess at the end of the day, it just comes down to you know, I'm lazy or not. It comes down to the fact that how do you look at me? I want to think I'm lazy because I don't write. Um, anything a story anymore but on the other hand i'm writing twice the amount of what i would do for a story in other places you know developing a story in uh, i do rp i do online role play <laughs> and i write a lot in there and some of it is good almost i mean it's rp how good can it be but yeah, I don't know why am I doing this. Uh, let me take a sip. I'm I'm really distraught at the moment. Over something so stupid that I don't know how to deal with it. I guess I never fully matured as a human being, and it's too late to do it now. It's at best, and I do mean at best, I'm one-fourth of my life in. It makes me shudder. Anyways. Uh, so how is it going with you people? <laughs> there is there are other stuff that... Uh, I do think I can improve too, and I, I know if I set my mind to it, I will probably do it. Uh, like learning uh, color correction, not professional grade color correction, just something that makes my videos don't look as raw as they do. Um, audio mastering to a beginner's degree, so my videos again don't sound like shit. And these are stuff that, well, um, if I want to, I can learn. Not only there are a lot of good resources online, I do have friends who I'm pretty sure can teach me all of this. But I don't. Why? No reason, honestly. I think I, at the end of the day, I'm just lazy. But... Yeah, I, I guess I'm just lazy. Well, I solved that mid-episode. 
and literally made the episode. I'm just 10 minutes in. God damn it, am I just lazy? I'm not saying I'm not. I mean, if you look at me, I look like a lazy person. I'm overweight. So I might say dangerously overweight, and I would say just mildly overweight. No, I'm dangerously overweight. They are wrong. They are right. I mean, I'm wrong. What the fuck is wrong with me? And um, I spend a lot of time doing nothing, just watching YouTube video, and worse than that, re-watching YouTube video. I haven't even seen a movie in a long time, which I need to. And I'm always justifying, oh, you know, this Saturday, in Iran, Saturday is the beginning of the week. This Saturday I'm going to do it. And it, that, that Saturday never comes. The problem is, at least to some extent, I know if I start doing it, I will finish it. You know, people can attest to that, that if I start a project, I will finish it and I will hate myself for every step of the way, which is why I don't really start projects. Because I know I'm unable to stop. So if I'm unable to stop, you know. (laughs) I think I need to mention why I'm distraught at the moment, but I don't want to. It's really stupid. And I don't know what they listen to this, but what if they do? (laughs) I'm putting it out in the open and I don't really want to do that. So this last week has been kind of... Oh, by the way, the test thing. I still haven't done that. Again, I guess I'm too lazy or I'm too afraid. I don't know. The problems are mingling with each other. But yeah, I've even printed out like answer sheets so I can fill them. And I haven't still done that. I maybe after I record this, maybe I go and do that. But I still haven't done that. Same with a lot of other projects. And okay, this part. If you are listening so far, thank you. I know this one is a train wreck and I do appreciate if you are not going to listen to me be extremely vulnerable and whiny just remember to like and subscribe and you can you know end the episode right here but if you are listening <laughs> I feel like I'm I'm I feel a nihilistic cloud over my head why am i doing all of the things that i'm doing it doesn't matter i'm going to die one day and death seems ever closer to me with each day and i don't know what to do i'm afraid i have mental disorders i'm uh But life needs to go on and I'm stuck here. I I don't mean in Iran. I mean in my body, in my mind, in my lack of abilities at the moment. And so I justify it to myself by saying I'm not lazy. I just don't have the right equipment to not be lazy. But the truth is I do have a lot of equipment. I do have almost all of the equipment needed to not be lazy, but I still am. <laughs> uh, I have a problem, my blood is too thick. And that that is not a joke, it's really a problem. And it's not because I'm fat, by the way, it's 
it's a, a genetic issue my dad also has the problem and one of the side effects of that is uh, well there are uh, being just not in the mood all the time <laughs> and uh, I'm thinking oh if I go and do that I will become productive I will do all the stuff that I needed to do I will bring back the YouTube channel I will finally finish um, rereading American Gods which I need to do in order to write a script and I will sit down and write my stories but the truth of the matter is I probably won't and I wonder why am I always alone in a romantic kind of way I never had a relationship. I mean, who would we want to go out with a fucking lazy guy? I'm afraid the train of life has passed and I've stuck behind. And I'm too optimistic or too much in denial to notice it or acknowledge it. I feel old. I'm broken. And honestly useless. God knows what. Anyways, uh, God damn it, what, there's three minutes left. <laughs> God damn it. I do want to hear from you and uh, so far one person has messaged me and that was one of the weirdly proud moments of my life. I was really proud that someone was touched by this little thing I do every Friday. I sometimes also simply feel um, unlikable, you know, like yeah, unlikable. I guess I am. Based on the recent thing that happened, I guess I am just very unlikable. I am needy and greedy god damn it I'm thinking of that fucking song from Hallelujah the Devil's Carnival the, the songs of all it's so easy breezy when the music starts I'm dafty for a random melody <laughs> yeah but things seem to be better. I mean, the YASP is picking up steam. My own channel is picking up steam. And uh, people seem to like some of the stuff I do. You know, one day, what I'm going to do? I'm going to sit down every single friend I have. Like, every single one of them. Or acquaintances or people who have seen me in the street anyone who has ever talked to me sit them down and interrogate them and yes I do mean that in a literal sense interrogate them as to what they've seen in me what I finally didn't do what I said what what do they see in me if you have an answer for that, please don't forget to comment it so I see it. Or send me a message on Anchor if you want. I'm really sorry. This one it was a train wreck. But I hope by next week I can do one much better. <laughs>